Welcome to the most electrifying channel in all entertainment. This is your boy PK. When I be drops some news about Mega 10 2020. First I'd like to say when I watched this premiere, it was great to hear Yugi's voice again. Some voices are just iconic in that way, and Yugi's is definitely one of them. Konami always show loves to these two iconic characters, Kaiba and Yugi. Today, Konami shows brand new TCG cards designed to work with both Dark Magician and Blue Eyes White Dragon decks. I would say that it appears to be more favor towards Dark Magician compared to Blue Eyes, but these cards can work at both decks. First, let's get to the card everyone knows about, and that is Red Eyes Dark Dragoon. In this Mega Ten, if you didn't know, he's a dark spellcaster fusion monster. 3000 attack, 2500 defense. He uses Dark Magician and Red Eyes Black Dragon as his materials, which is pretty dope. And then this, this plays into other cards later on. It says, this card cannot be destroyed by card effects. Neither player can target this card with card effects. During your main phase, you can destroy one monster your opponent controls. And if you do, inflict damage to your opponent equal to the monster's attack you can use this effect up to the number of number of times per turn up to the normal monsters used as fusion material for this card once per turn a card effect or card or card effect is activated this is a quick effect you can discard one card negate the activation and if you do destroy that card this card gains a thousand attacks this card is powerful it can burn your opponent twice you can't target it for any kind of effects and it has a negate this is already a way to sell this megaton next we have successor soul in my opinion this is the best new card shown it's a quick play spell tribute one effect monster then target one effect monster your opponent controls send it to the graveyard and special summon one level seven or higher normal monster from your hand or deck you could activate one successor soul per turn only attack with one monster during the turn you activate this card this card is a combo heavy with both blue eyes and dark magician decks using any of the star cards as fodder to sin using a sin spot removal type and summon either from your deck or hand this is too good keeping it in both decks is very playable because dark magician and blue eyes have a lot of starter cards that are fodder after you've done their effects you don't need them anymore plus it's a quick play so you can use it to to make a disruption on your opponent's turn though on the dark magician deck it seems to be more useful because of dark dark magician circle that you know is another spot removal next we have destin rivals it's a normal trap if you control a blue eyes white dragon or dark magician Magician, negate the effects of all faced up monsters your opponent currently controls at the end of the turn. You can only activate one Destiny Rivals per turn. Now this is cool. It's a trap card. It pretty much is like a Dark Ruler no more on your opponent's turn. In Dark Magician deck, you can search this card using cards like Soul Servant or Dark Magician Circle. As of right now, there's no way to search this card in any Blue Eyes decks. Though this is a steal, this is still a solid trap card. Able to shut your opponent down on their turn is awesome. Now we have Strength and Unity. It's a continuous spell. It says if you Ritual or Fusion Summon using Blue Eyes White Dragon and Dark Magician, you can target one card your opponent controls or in their graveyard. Banish it. If you send this face up card from the field to the graveyard, then target one level seven or higher normal monster in your graveyard. Add it to your hand or shuffle it into your deck. You can use the effect of strength and unity once per turn. I noticed that on this card, it doesn't list anything outside of fusion and ritual, which is interesting because we know that blue eyes themed decks have themed synchro monsters and dark magician has themed exceed monsters. So maybe they made this card in a mindset of what they what Dark Magician and Blue Eyes both share in common to try and keep it to where they both can use the card. Though I don't really see this as a necessary card to use. You have many more options that are very playable. So I will say even in the end, though Dark Magician and Blue Eyes can use this card, it may more of a Dark Magician card. Well, that's all for me, guys. Hey, tell me down in the description below, are you guys excited for more Dark Magician and Blue Eyes support? Are you happy with the current Lost Memories Mega 10 2020? Don't forget to electrify that subscribe button and hit the bell to keep up on my latest content. See you next time.